What's up, everybody? My name is Lei Hua, and welcome to the Super Frina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcasts across worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lei Hua Super Frina. Today, we are reacting to Final Fantasy XIV's last, latest, actually, latest expansion, Endwalker full trailer. You may be asking why, and that is because I stream Final Fantasy XIV. Yes, on twitch.tv slash Lei Hua Super Frina. This is the awaited expansion. Expansion. We got a small trailer earlier. We have an idea what's going on. We saw the notes for the new expansion. And now we're going to get the full trailer. We're going to see things in motion, animated, things that we only seen in pictures. And we're going to see the new Melee DPS. It gave us a sneak peek in 5.5 of Final Fantasy XIV. In the latest patch, we saw that they were teasing. We saw Xenos looking at all these weapons and he picked one up, but it was blocked by a pillar. And we're going to see it in this trailer. Super excited for it. I, oh, I'm so excited. Okay, let's go. Let's just do it. Let's watch it. Hey, what's up? Okay, so we have the moon. That was the theme. I have people, friends, people. I have friends who are getting gear, items for glamour, so they can have a moon theme just for this expansion. And it looks like he's walking on the moon so we're all thinking we're going to the moon! Okay, we got a map! The final days were upon us. The fabric of the star had begun to fray, its lash rent by tooth and claw. <laughs> Hey, Alize, I like your outfit. Got that red jacket, red mage. <laughs> oh, we match. I think that's a paladin, a tank. And we got the stage. That's Alphino. What's up? Look after myself, you know. How is they being all you know, independent? This right. Come on. Oh, look at these creatures. You got like the star seems to be ice. Anyways, you got these creatures that have like tentacles going on. We got the mother of the dragons. Obsidian! What up, Obsidian? Dragoon! Yeah. <laughs> okay, we got the Askin dude. What up? And this evil looking tower. You want to, I believe, put people in thrall, like an icon. The stage is set, but will our healers deign to play their part? Thank you. What up? Tis as we feared. The respite afforded this land was but fleeting. <laughs> The end draws nigh. Man, they made Fangrid look so realistic in this. Did they always make Fangrid look realistic in these trailers? Charline, this is where we're gonna go. They hinted this in the latest patch 5.5.
Raya was saying that we need to go here to figure out what's going on, what's going to do next. But the Charlene's, they're like neutral, so they don't want to do anything that interferes with such. I knew it. The star still has secrets to tell. Rahatia, what up, what up? Hello. Are we going to be interacting with you more? Keep its council, or the world is lost to ruin. It would. Give it to them, Stola. Give them that shaft. We must. Do as you must, then. See? But we scions will fight until the heavens fall, until our last breath. Give no it be. Ooh, look at that! Is that the new weapon? Is that what he picked up? Dude, that looks like a scythe! I did not see that coming. I was thinking like a sword because he always, he always had a sword! Why a scythe? I wonder how that's gonna be used. Do you guys have any predictions how that weapon's gonna be played out? The melee DPS. Huh. Look at that! Blue planet with blue eyes, blue lining underneath the cape. And that looks like the moon. It looks like there's like a pattern of a dragon inside of this. Well, 2021! Woo! Yeah! Okay. What do you guys think about this trailer? Huh? Huh? There's some things that I picked up on. And let's see. The ones that I picked up on were the creatures. Let's see. This creature over here. I'm pretty sure we've seen this creature before, but it seems like we're going to see it more. I don't remember the name of this creature. If you know the name of this, put them in the comments. And then another thing that caught my eye were these creatures. Where are they? Creatures, creatures, where you at? Ah, here we go, here we go. This one. Doesn't this look kind of demonic, like the ones that... uh we saw in the those rays of the void that's what they remind me of i'm wondering if we're going to have a continuation of that probably not probably not <laughs> but this is interesting red face hair like tentacles arm like tentacles feet like gargoyles yeah. <laughs> and then let's see. We have floating islands. We have an area. Is this the new expansion? The one that looks more jun jungle like? That's like the new area we're going to cover, I believe. The jungle like area. I don't see the new uh, beast tribes. At least not yet. We got the mother of the dragons with Estinian riding on her. Estinian, yo! In the latest patch, 5.5, we were able to have more cutscenes with him, which totally means we're going to see him more. So this trailer confirms it because usually they show very prominent characters in these trailers. Let's yeah. And then as soon as Dragoon move. Oh, he's so handsome. Estinian, what up? Oh. Handsome man. Handsome Elzen. Handsome, handsome. Let's see. And then we got the Astian. We don't like him, but he's traveling in the tower. 
that enthralls victims. I believe it forces uh, the victims to make primals or acons, icons, acons, tomato, tomato. So Thancred and your Anja, la la la. Shh. This place is it Charlion? Let's go. Where is that? Oh, and we got. Grahatia, Grahatia in the library. Of course, absorbing all that information. Guarantee we're going to do something to try to get into that library. Because mm -hmm. that library, that room that he's in was locked up. It is a no people allow. So we're going to try to bust in there, right? Right. Fist bump. Okay, here we go. Here we go. This is, so I thought, I saw this person and I was thinking, Okay, there must be a reason why they're showing him. It means that we're going to encounter him a lot. So let's just play this part. So, Charlian will keep its counsel while the world is lost to ruin. Oh, Charlian. Charlian will keep to themselves. And that's because they're usually independent. They don't interfere. But the last time that happened, they got bocce. They lost an island. They lost people on that island. So I'm wondering if we're going to encounter that island that got lost and such. Because guaranteed we're going to be encountering them. And I'm wondering if we're going to investigate and look for that island, uncover it. There must be a reason why they're showing this map. I can't really read it. I'm wondering if it's a reflection to the beginning la, 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 the beginning ah oh, right here right here right here are you showing the map yes 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 so did this show this part over here if you can see where my mouse is i can't read this style but i'm pretty sure that there's this area here I'm wondering, oh, what part of the map are we going to go, though? Are we going more to the the west? This area where it's, like, covered, where we've never been before? Pretty sure we've been here before. Not too sure. But yeah. Is that why they show the map? Because we saw that map in the beginning? Here we go. Oh, and would keep its counsel while the world is lost to ruin. Let's see. Ooh, his map is a little different. It's like the opposite of mine. Opposite. Because remember I said west and that's more to the, the right of the map? His cloud stuff is more to the left. Oh, okay. Okay, so it looks like his map only cares about his side of this area that's surrounded by clouds they don't care about the east side they only care about the west side let me see if this is the same map let's see ah here we go here we go here we go it looks like it uh, i i'm trying to look for like an indication there's like a red part over here is it gonna clear Ooh, kind of clears Kinda. Eesh. <laughs> okay, here's the red part I'm talking about. Right here. Where my itty bitty arrow is. I was gonna say mouse icon, but <laughs> my arrow. Okay, so we got this right side here. Do, 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 do. Here you go. Let's look at your map. Oh, yeah! Interesting. Huh. Okay, so that's another thing that caught my eye. This place is huge. It has many, many levels. They have abundance of information. Very selfish of them to withhold that 
to keep that away. But very selfish of them to not help, okay? And I, I find it interesting that it's like a swirl here. Any other... Let's see, any other hints? So this weapon here looks like it's a fusion of organic and machine. It kind of reminds me of... Whatchamacallit? Machinist? Or Machinist? And Gunbreaker. But this is a melee DPS. Why is it made out of bones and machine? Hmm. I wonder how we're going to get this class. Who is going to give out this class? Where are we going to get this class? Normally, we get these classes in that expansion, right? Hmm, because we came from Shadowbringers, and that was in another world. How is this class going to be distributed? If you guys have any theories, let me know in the comments. And why does Xenos have it? Huh? Huh? Why did you change? Where did you get it from? That's another question. Where did you get it from? Oh, what if this isn't a new expansion? And it's bones because the new expansion for one of the areas is in a jungle-like area. Maybe that's why. Mm -hmm. Maybe it looks a little demonic because we saw those demonic creatures. But look at the scene right here. Let's play it. Right there. Oh, look at that. When he's looking at the moon, he pulls back the weapon. Yeah. And puts it over his shoulder like an axe. Like, this does look like a tank-like weapon, but it's a melee weapon. Very excited. I am very curious how this is going to be used. Most likely, it's going to be a long-range thing. A heavier weapon. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a lot of AOE uh, skills, techniques, and such. Ooh, I wonder what the rotation going to be like. What level are they going to start us with this? Are they going to make us start this at level 60, 70? What level? I'm pretty sure it was explaining what level. I'm just like, <gasps> I'm like six. I'm forgetting things. <laughs> Yes, this will be out. This last expansion will be out in fall 2021. Where's that date? Give me that date. There you go. Fall 2021. I'm excited. Are you excited? And that was my reaction to Final Fantasy XIV's latest expansion, Endwalker full trailer oh, i really like this trailer oh it was so much better than the last one that we saw what do you think about this trailer what do you think about this video let me know in the comments below and if you want to talk outside of youtube there's a discord discord link is available in the description and i also stream on twitch.tv slash superfina i stream final fantasy 14 so if you want to stop by the stream talk about this trailer while i'm playing final fantasy 14 you are more than welcome and if you play in Primal Hyperion, you are welcome to play with me. Let me know if you want to play. Outside of Twitch and YouTube, I host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime, manga, and other things we're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, we are available on all platforms. Link to the podcast is in the description. Other than that, my name is Lihua, and this was a Super Fina channel reacting to Final Fantasy XIV, the latest expansion, and Walker Full Trailer. Hope you guys like this video, and I will see you on the next one. Laters! Huge thanks to my Patreons and channel members for making this video possible. If you also want to be part of the Superfina party, you can click over here or become a channel member. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss the next video. And I do stream live on Twitch every Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Hope to see you guys there and I will see you on the next video. This bump.